we've got big fun waiting to be unleashed. We'll be posing some of life's most important questions. Your answers will be paired off in a no-holds-barred tournament. And your votes will determine which answers advance in the bracket. As we whittle down to our championship winner, this is Bracketeering! I'm sending the topic of our first bracket to your devices now. The grossest thing for a human to cough up. Apparently we're really going for the ick factor with this one. Type in the answer you think has the best chance of winning and hit send. If your answer wins the entire bracket, you'll be rolling in moolah. By the way, you can join the audience and play along by going to jackbox.tv and entering the room code. Your answers are being paired off into one-on-one -on -one matchups. That means it's time to seek our fortune at the prediction table. On your device, you'll see one of the upcoming matchups for this bracket. If you can predict the answer that will get the most votes, you could win some sizable bonus bucks. Oh, and don't forget, if you think your own answer is going to crap the bed, you can still get that... The predictions are in. It's time to dive into our first bracket. Never thought I'd see this matchup. Use your device to vote on which you think deserves to win. But don't forget, if you change your mind, you can change your vote. This one seems like it's over before it's done. Made it by an itty bitty. A ching for any prediction winners. Next up. I am on the edge of my seat. This one took it over. Oh, that win was so big, you could hear it in the next state over. Everyone bets on the favorite and cashes in. Let's see what tensions are mounting over in the Omega Conference. This is one for the ages. was a slaughter. What an upset. No one saw this one coming. It's time to round out the bracket with this vicious matchup. A slight lead taking shape. The struggle is real. This one seems like it's over before it's done. I do not like that at all. Before we get on to round two, it's time to make another prediction. You've got a new matchup waiting for you on your device. Predict the one you think is going to win. The predictions are in. Let's jump back to our bracket for round two. A clear favorite. Come out on top. It doesn't get any closer than that. Crib just.
just one match away from our finals. Only one can come out on top. A real tug of war. That was a clash of the titans! And now the definitive matchup! What is the grossest thing for a human to cough up? by tapping on your device as fast as you can. We have our first winner. Wow, what a bracket. Let's see how the score shook out. Time for the blind bracket. All you'll be given is the category. Name something really boring to do. Go ahead and write the first thing that comes to mind. We'll see the real bracket title after the answers are all in. see what this bracket is really about. The coolest thing you could do in a senior photo. I could have used this advice in 1973. Time to get in those predictions. Predictions are in. It's go time. It's weird that this is my job. This might be a photo finish. will not be denied. <laughs> Moving on to our next matchup. This one's looking over already. It's really going back and forth. This one seems like it's over before it's done. I don't believe it! Let's see what's happening over on the other side of the bracket. Set in the making. This 
one could be decided by a single vote. Everything has changed. And now our last two contenders face off. It's really going back and forth. Just running out the clock now. That kind of domination is illegal in some states. Before we get on to round two, it's time to make another prediction. The predictions are in. Let's jump back to our bracket for round two. This is a big one. No one thought it would be this close. This one's going down. That had more dangerous swings than an abandoned playground. This could be the answer to beat, but let's check out the competition. And now we finally decide what is the coolest thing to do in a senior photo. a winner. Let's take another peek at the scoreboard. For the bracket you've all been waiting for, the triple blind bracket. This bracket will change every single round. Let's start with a category. Name a cartoon character. Who knows what crazy twists and turns this bracket will take. running out let's see what we're dealing with the most annoying cartoon character time to get in those predictions all cash is doubled this round so make these choices count The predictions are in. Let's see our first matchup. The 
this struggle is real. It's anyone's game. Stop, drop, and roll. There's cash if you predicted this one. Our next matchup. It looks like we have one just beginning to pull ahead. The lead keeps changing hands. This one seems like it's over before it's done. A regular juggernaut. Looks like this one was obvious. Why don't we see what's going on on the other side of the bracket? Two titans squaring off. I am on the edge of my seat! Will we see a final push? Well, that should fill the empty void of your existence for a while. It's time to round out the bracket with this vicious matchup. Heavyweights went back and forth, but there can only be one victor. Let's switch up this bracket. Which cartoon character has a dark secret? Get those predictions in now. Predictions are in. Let's jump back to our bracket for round two. Former teammates, will these two answers be able to stay focused on the matchup? It's really going back and forth. Clear winner there. One more match to determine our finals. These answers exchanged some harsh words at the press conference. Switch. Most likely to break your heart. I hope your answer still makes sense. And now the definitive matchup. Motors are being loud and clear on this one. The lead keeps changing hands. Decided by a single vote. They brought their A game today. But who walked away with the top score?
Monster. I'm your host, Felicia the Teeth Nasher, which is why I have this retainer. I'll be hosting six nights of creepy co-mingling, where you'll try to convince other players to go out with you by sending them secret messages. Each night, you'll chat with other players before locking in the one person you want to date that night. If that person picks you back, you go on a date and both earn a heart. At the end of the game, the monster with the most hearts wins. Usually. Did I mention you're all secretly monsters? Check your devices now to see your secret powers and how you can earn bonus hearts if you put them to good use. This is going to be really scary. I mean fun. This is going to be fun. Let's start by chatting with other players and trying to set up dates. You can only send four messages each night, so use them wisely. Conversations might be seen by everyone during the date. My bad. your messages. Don't dilly-dally. Okay, time's up. Now, on your device, pick the one person you hope you're going on a date with tonight. I'm keeping my mandible crossed for everyone to do well. Okay, let's see who everyone tried to date. And if you don't get a date, don't worry. This is just the first night. Looks like someone had the same idea. Let's see. Talk 
executive do really hit it off. <laughs> Looks like someone else wanted in on that action and failed. Wow, what an exciting first night. Let's maybe salt those wounds a wee bit by going to the scoreboard. So you are doing the best, and you're temporarily in last place. A quick word of warning. Whoever is in the top spot at the end of the second night of dates will have their monster power revealed. And every night after that, we'll do the same for the highest ranking unrevealed monster. Oh, by the way, there's a full moon out tonight, in case that affects your monster power. We all know how this works by now. Message away! If you need to block another player, when you hit the info button on their chat screen, there's a block button in there, and then you won't see their messages. Alright, it's time to pick dates again. So, did we learn any useful life lessons the first night? We'll find out. It's date time. Don't go yet, there's more. Rejection for our extra lonely heart over there. This is going to end. Let's see if that changed any of the standings. Wow, some serious movement. Don't forget, from now on, at the end of each night, a new monster will be revealed. You're at the top. Let's take a peek at your monster identity. The mother receives a bonus heart every night their child does not get a date. If you need to read that again, you can always see the monster power rules for a revealed player by hitting the info button on their chat screen. Message time! Oh, a quick word of advice. If one of the other players isn't getting much attention, they might be more receptive to date offers.
just 20 more seconds. Once again, it's time to pick your date. This is my favorite part. It's date time. Stick around, there's another one for you. We know this ends badly. No date for the child means a bonus heart for the mother. Any of that changed the social pecking order. Tiny steps, tiny changes. You're the highest unrevealed player, so let's see. Mommy! Everyone the mummy dates becomes cursed. Then, so do the players they date. At the end of the game, mummies steal half a heart from every cursed player. But, if everyone has been cursed, then the curse is lifted and no hearts are stolen. Uh-oh, full moon tonight. Get to messaging. Seconds and counting. Okay, time's up. All right, it's time to pick dates again. Oh, love, so much potential for disaster and heartbreak. Let's see the date. Wait! Someone's lining up hoping to be next. Let's see what happens.
No date for the child means a bonus heart for the mother. We already know how this will go. Let's see what's what now. Definitely saw some movement in there. Okay, let's see your secret. Body Swapper! On a full moon, the body swapper swaps hearts, all of them, with the person they successfully date. That's quite a power. Night flies. Ooh, full moon fever. Message time. being a matchmaking monster. Let's see those dates. <laughs> you thought that one little message was going to work, huh? more. We know this ends badly. get a bonus heart for dating, and then turn their dates into a werewolf. But if a werewolf is rejected on a full moon, they lose half a heart. Last night. It's our last night together. Make it count. And you get two hearts for dating tonight instead of one because it's such a special night. Last night. Get to messaging. Oh, 
for you. for the child means a bonus heart for the mother. Don't go yet. There's more. This is going to end. Let's see the almost final standing. One last thing. It's time for the after party. Time to reveal any remaining hidden monster powers. Time for another reveal. Witch! The witch takes a hair from each new player they date. When revealed, the witch receives one bonus heart for every hair collected. Leprechaun! Everyone who dates an unrevealed leprechaun gets two fake hearts. When the leprechaun is revealed, that's right now, all the fake hearts disappear. At this moment, leprechauns get one bonus heart for every player that drops in the rankings. One player dropped in the rankings. Invisible person! The invisible person started the game with two bonus hearts. The invisible person's score is invisible, so they appear to be in last place until the end of the game. Time to tally up any after-party bonus hearts. Let's see if anybody became a werewolf. No bonus hearts for that. I just like to know who's a werewolf. Time to see who received the mummy's curse. Don't forget, the mummy steals half a heart from all the cursed players unless they can break the curse by spreading it to everyone. The mummy's cleaning up. How does that affect the final standings?
Hi, I'm your host, Cookie Masterson. I'm also a notary, in case that comes up. All right, six players. I didn't think you had this many friends, but okay. Oh, and uh, anyone else can get in and join the audience. The audience gets to throw extra lies into the mix and guess the truth along with players. Let's hit it. This is round one. You'll pick up 500 points for everybody you fool. And you'll score 1,000 for finding the truth. All right, choose a category. Here's the first question. In 2017, police in Lakewood, Florida, were called about a man who was blank in a busy street. Now, use your device to put in a lie that you think will trick the other players into believing it. If you can't think of anything, that lie for me button will give you a suggestion for half the points. Do it now. So here are your choices. Look for the truth and tap it on your device. All right, who picked what? The real crime was that he was using light syrup. Select the category. All right, here it is. To promote a 2002 video game, Acclaim offered $10,000 to anyone who would blank. Okay, enter your lies. All right, where's the truth? Let's see what everybody selected. To rock or not to rock, that is the question. OK, 
Pick a category. Okay, focus up. According to the Brigham Young University Honor Code, students need a letter from a doctor in order to blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Okay, what did everyone pick? <laughs> nice fibbing. It's all part of the Affordable Hair Act. Thank you! On to round two, where all point values are doubled. Give me a category. Now listen up. In 2015, Finnish police started a strange social media campaign asking the public to report anyone selling blank. Write your lies now. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, find the truth. All right, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> that was a big one. Try this on for size. The campaign was supposed to crack down on tax evasion, but everyone knows snitches don't get slices. Time to pick a category. I see you can't be bothered. Try this one. 
After the short-lived Friends spin-off, Joey was canceled. The living room set was turned into a training simulator for blank. All right, type in your lies. Okay, seek the truth. Let's see how things shook out. That must explain why they handle so many cases of nausea. Okay, you can look at this, but don't touch. The odd title of this Paul Clay drawing is In Memory of Blank. Enter your lies now. All right, pick the truth. And what did people pick? Oh right, I had their greatest hit CD. This is the final fibbage. One question left for triple the points. Good luck. NASA researcher Scott A. Sanford published a tongue-in-cheek 1995 study that compared blank and blank. Type in your lies now. Okay, look for the truth and pick it.
Okay, let's take a look. Who says astrophysicists can't be hilarious? <laughs> 